Yo, YouTube, what's good? Darian, that app guy, Johnson, back again. Excited to bring you guys another episode, some more workout tips for you guys, all right? Today, I'm gonna bring you my five favorite cable core exercises, okay? So the purpose of this workout is it's a nice little switch up from your typical dumbbell and body weight core exercises, okay? It's just something a little different. My background as a former athlete, I learned a lot of these exercises from when I used to play football back in the day. So I'm excited to put my own little twist to it and bring you guys that work, all right? So without further ado, let's dive into it. First exercise, all right? You guys need to be here. You don't want to put too much weight on this, okay? So your core is gonna be engaged the entire time, okay? So you're gonna grab here. Boom. So it's like a wood chop, except you're going the opposite way, all right? So you're gonna stretch all the way out, core engaged, boom. Bring it down to the other side. Keep your arms and elbows straight the entire time. All right, you wanna eliminate, you don't wanna bend your elbows. You wanna keep your arms nice and straight and crunch. All right, so for this exercise, the purpose of this exercise is it's gonna target your obliques, okay? It's kind of like a different version of Russian twists. They both work the same thing, okay? Just a different way. So yeah, for reps and sets for this exercise, I recommend you do 12 to 15, all right? Each side, all right? So once you do this side here, boom. You're gonna turn around, all right, same thing. Three. Core engaged the entire time. Get that stretch, fill it all the way. Boom. 12, 12 to 15, all right? Every single exercise that we do today. So each of these workouts that I'm gonna take you guys through all right, is gonna target a different part of your abs, okay? So for this exercise, this one's for the obliques. So make sure you guys got one of these one of these handles right here, all right, usually used for the tricep extension. We're gonna grab that. You guys have probably seen this exercise before, okay? This one, you're gonna go a little bit heavier, not too heavy. You wanna make sure you're able to get quality reps. All right, we got 12 to 15. All right, so you're gonna, you're gonna hold the weight right behind your head, okay? You're gonna bend your, bend your arms, okay? And we're gonna crunch. Keep the core engaged, keep your glutes engaged, okay? Boom. All right, 12 of those. You guys should feel that in the upper part of your abs, okay? So, 12 to 15, every single one. All right, so next exercise, we're back to this, this handle right here, okay? Back to obliques. Kind of the same as the first exercise we did in this video, but a little bit different because we're gonna rotate all the way to the other side and back over, okay? So, 12, 12 reps. Core engaged the entire time. Yep, 12 of those. You should feel it in your obliques, also directly in the middle of your abdomen. All right, should be burning the entire time. All right, so fourth exercise. Now this one is more of a, a core stabilizer, okay? This one's gonna help you keep your core engaged. In order to do this properly, your core has to be engaged the entire time, okay? So you're not gonna be rotating or anything. This one, we're gonna take some weight. 
a weight that you can, you can kind of handle comfortably, okay? Slight bend in the knee, chest up, press. Then we'll go to the other side, obviously, do 12 more. This exercise, I specifically learned from playing football. I remember doing this, this exercise in college, like every single week, every single week, uh, just to help us keep our core engaged, all right? Core and glutes, the entire time. We're gonna do 12 here. <clears throat> All right guys, so now for the, the next exercise, gonna be a lot different on this one, okay? You're gonna be targeting the bottom portion of your abs, okay, but you'll feel it all throughout. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take one of these, we're gonna move it all the way down. Now, if you have, if you don't have any access to a, to an ankle strap in your gym, that's okay, that's fine. You can still use this little, this little connection right here, okay? You'll just attach your foot to it at the bottom, all right? And you'll complete the workout as such. But I do have an ankle strap, so I'm gonna go ahead and use that. I'll tighten that up. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go all the way back here, all right, where there's some resistance, some resistance on the, uh, the cable, all right? And we're gonna go here. Stretch all the way out. Bring that opposite elbow to the knee. Twelve. Woo! I'm telling you, twelve of those. I'm gonna go ahead and switch sides, but. I'm gonna show you guys, if you're more advanced, all right, I'm gonna show you a different variation that you can do that'll make the, the workout a little more challenging, all right? So, all right, so for my, all my advanced people, what we're gonna do this time is, instead of having that opposite leg resting on the ground, you're gonna hold it up, okay? I just took you guys through was one set, all right? So all five of these exercises I took you guys through, 12 reps, that's one set. All right, after that, you wanna rest about a minute, a minute and a half, cause you're doing core. So give yourself time, all right? And you wanna complete this circuit three times, okay? Don't recommend it, don't, I don't recommend you guys going any more than three sets because not really necessary. Your abs will probably start cramping at some point. All right, so three sets of this, your abs will be burning and that should last you an entire week. So thank you guys for tuning in to the channel. All right, if you like this workout, go ahead and hit that thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, share with a friend, okay? And for more ab exercises, go ahead and visit my website, darianj.com, all right? And grab my ab ebook, very beginner friendly and all the work you need is there. So thank you guys for tuning in and I'll catch you next time. Peace.